Okay, so let's get to the important part of the video. Now, um, I've recently released a couple of videos showing you the new tackle that's coming out in Japan. Um, and a lot of these new products are going to be released really soon. So there's probably quite a few of you guys that are going to uh, be going online and looking to buy these things. And now, of course, you know, we like to save money and try to get the best deal that we can and pay the lowest cost that we can. So um, some of us may be susceptible to some fraudulent fake shops. And that's the best way I can put it. So uh, I think I found a couple of examples of fraudulent and fake shops. Now I'm go not going to list them out or name them by name, but you can probably look at the pictures and uh, see uh, the web address and uh, know what I'm talking about. So let's begin. Okay, so before we get into the important part of this video, uh, I want to show you guys something that, uh, that I missed when showing the new Shimano's and that is the new 2018 Poison Adrena rod line. Now this uh, rod line has got me really excited. Um, they made one major change to it. Now I have the old model um, with the uh, carbon monocoque rear grip but the new model has a full carbon monocoque grip so there's no uh, EVA foam, there's no uh, cork uh, and because of this full carbon monocoque grip they say that the vibration transmission has went up 28 percent over the old model and the old model was really sensitive already so uh, hopefully they'll bring this uh, rod line to America for us to enjoy um, that way it'll save us on some shipping and you'll get a warranty as well now if you guys haven't checked it out already I'm gonna leave a link in the description and in the comments um, to my original video um, on how to buy JDM Tackle. So let's start out uh, with the first shop that I found out about. Um, just to give you guys a little bit of an example, let's say you're looking for a Shimano Stella saltwater 20,000 size spinning reel. Now, of course, the Stella is the top of the line uh, spinning reel from Shimano, so it's gonna cost uh, an arm and a leg and probably two kidneys so you're going to try to find a deal on it so the first thing that I do is I go to the regular shops and uh, as you can see I'm going to post a picture this is a uh, I believe it's Tackle Direct um, which is a uh, you know a brick and mortar store and you can order online um, and you can see the price of the Stella is $1,259.99 that's a lot of money so the next thing you do is you go to eBay to see if you can find a better deal which you know a lot of us do and the cheapest I found for a brand new Stella saltwater 20,000 size was $939 that's still an arm and a leg and two kidneys okay so let's say you did a lot of searching and searching on Google etc etc and you come across a shop that sells the Stella saltwater 20,000 size and you click on the price and you see it's $425 and you know let's uh, go over the four things that uh, I said in the previous video that are red flags of potential fake and fraud sites now the number one thing was the price was too good to be true so at $425 you know that's that's the first red flag right there now okay so let's say that you are curious enough and you want to actually try to buy that now if you can see in the quantity section that's right next to add to cart it, it's already pre-populated with the number five all right so let's say you change that to one because you only want one reel and you try to add to cart. Now if you look at that pink strip, it says minimum order amount for Shimano Stella Saltwater 20,000 PG spinning reel new is five. So the second red flag that I mentioned was that the shops want you to buy a minimum of at least five 
reels. Now, who buys five stellas at a time? I know um, I don't. So, there's your uh, second red flag right there. Okay, so at this point, we're changing the quantity to five. And we are wanting to check out. Now, remember the uh, third thing that I said was a red flag of a uh, fake fraud site was that they always want you to pay with a bank transfer. You can't pay with PayPal, you can't pay with a credit card because those things offer protection. And a bank transfer, once you've transferred funds to another account, whether it be fraud or not, that money's gone. So we click over to the payment and it says the only option there is bank transfer as you can see. So yeah, there we go, that's the uh, a fraud site. Now let's go over a second example here of another fraud site. Okay so let's say you are looking for the top of the line Daiwa spinning reel which is uh, the Daiwa Exist. So let's say you're looking for the 3012 model. So you go online, you go on eBay, and you find on eBay the cheapest one is $625. And then you see another one that's $589. Now these are uh, sellers that have positive feedback, as you can see, over 99%. But let's say you're, you're so cheap that you want it even cheaper than that. So you come across this site right here and you see the die will exist there and their price is only $350. So that's, that's uh, almost half off. Now the first red flag there, of course, is the price is too good to be true. Now here's another little red flag that you Daiwa guys probably will catch is that I don't think that there is a, a new 2017 uh, model exist. I think uh, it was only 2015 until the new one that came out. That came out this year. Okay, so the price is too good to be true, and as you can see, the quantity is already populated to five automatically. So let's say you change the quantity to one, and you get that same. Uh, warning there that says the minimum order for Daiwa 2017 exists. Spinning reel new is five. Okay, so you change the quantity to five, and then you go all the way to the payment section, and as you can see, they only take a bank transfer. So there we go. Now keep a uh, keep uh, an eye on that uh, name there. It says Banax Tackle Asia. Now this site here is. Extremely dangerous in my opinion because Banax is actually there's a a, uh, a manufacturing plant in Korea called Banax and they make a lot of uh, OEM reels for a lot of American uh, reel companies. So there's actually a Banax um, Korean manufacturer and they actually sell their own Banax reels in Korea. Um, so this site is, is uh, really tricky with that name. Now this is not affiliated with Banax Korea at all. It just shows the name Banax Tackle Shop. I think for the purpose of fooling people. So now what was the fourth step that I said is, is do some research. Google, um, Google these shops and let me show you what I found. Now, there's a site apparently called Ripoff Report where they've been reported, and it looks like these two websites are actually the same people. And as it shows here, that uh, the report by this person, he sent them $3,200 and they never, he never got a thing. So that sucks for him, but it looks like. Uh, the Banax Tackle Shop and Real Fishing Best is the same uh, con artist ripping people off. So there you go. That's an example. I don't know why they're still up and running. I guess whatever country they're in, it looks like they're in Indonesia, which is sad. Um, 
the authorities refuse to do anything about it. And it's not like we can do anything about it here in America. So the best thing to do is just stay away from them. And I'm sure if their sites get shut down, they'll pop up with a new one. But now that you know the tricks, you will be protected. All right, guys. Thanks a lot.